Question 1. At an intersection with a stop sign, you should stop and A. Go when the intersection is clear. B. Wait for all cars to pass before proceeding. C. Go immediately as you have the right of way. Answer. A. Go when the intersection is clear. Always ensure it's safe to proceed. Question 2. When a pedestrian is in a crosswalk, you must A. Slow down and proceed with caution. B. Stop and wait for them to cross. C. Honk to alert them. Answer. B. Stop and wait for them to cross. Pedestrians have the right of way in crosswalks. Question 3. True or false. Using a handheld phone while driving is allowed if you're checking maps. Answer. False. Handheld phone use while driving is prohibited, regardless of the reason. Question 4. Before changing lanes, you should A. Check your rearview mirror. B. Check your mirrors and look over your shoulder for blind spots. C. Signal and change lanes immediately. Answer. B. Check your mirrors and look over your shoulder for blind spots. Always ensure the lane is clear. Question 5. Children under the age of blank must be secured in a child passenger restraint system. A. 4. B. 6. C. 8. Answer. C. 8. Children under 8 years old must be secured in the proper child restraint system. Question 6. When you see a flashing red light at an intersection, you should A. Slow down and proceed if clear. B. Treat it as a stop sign and stop completely. C. Proceed without stopping. Answer. B. Treat it as a stop sign and stop completely. Then proceed when safe. Question 7. True or false. You should always yield to emergency vehicles with sirens and lights on. Answer. True. Pull over to the right and stop to allow them to pass. Question 8. A solid yellow line in your lane means A. You may pass if safe. B. You may not pass. C. You're in a carpool lane. Answer. B. You may not pass. A solid yellow line indicates no passing in that lane. Question 9. At a roundabout, you should A. Yield to incoming traffic and use your signal before exiting. B. Enter without yielding as you have the right of way. C. Always turn right to exit. Answer. A. Yield to incoming traffic and use your signal before exiting. Question 10. True or false. Bicyclists have the same rights and responsibilities as motor vehicle drivers. Answer. True. Bicyclists must follow the same traffic laws as drivers of motor vehicles. Question 11. You must park. Blank. Fee away from a fire hydrant. A. 5. B. 10. C. 15. Answer. C. 15. It's illegal to park within 15 feet of a fire hydrant. Question 12. The speed limit in a school zone, unless otherwise posted, is A. 15 miles per hour B. 25 miles per hour C. 35 miles per hour Answer. B. 25 miles per hour Always be alert in school zones and watch for children. Question 13. At a T-intersection without signs or signals, the vehicle on the through road A. Must yield to the vehicle on the terminating road B. Has the right of way C. Must wait for three seconds before proceeding. Answer. B. Has the right of way. Question 14. True or false. It's legal to leave a child six years or younger unattended in a vehicle if the child is supervised by a person 12 years or older. Answer. True. However, it's still not recommended due to potential risks. Question 15. If you see livestock on the road, you should. A. Sound your horn continuously. B. Drive slowly and give them space. C. Accelerate to scare them off the road. Answer. B. Drive slowly and give them space. Question 16. On a divided highway, the blank colored lane is usually the carpool lane. 
A. Red. B. Yellow. C. White. Answer. B. Yellow. Carpool lanes are often demarcated with yellow lines. Question 17. You're required to turn on your headlights. A. 30 minutes after sunset to 30 minutes before sunrise. B. Only during nighttime. C. Anytime visibility is low. Answer. A. 30 minutes after sunset to 30 minutes before sunrise. Additionally, anytime visibility is compromised. Question 18. When parking uphill with a curb, turn your wheels. A. Towards the curb. B. Away from the curb. C. Straight ahead. Answer. B. Away from the curb. This way, if the vehicle rolls, it will roll into the curb. Question 19. True or false. If your vehicle is equipped with a hands-free system, you may use your phone while driving. Answer. True. However, you should minimize distractions while driving. Question 20. To avoid tailgating, one should follow the A. One-second rule B. Two-second rule C. Three-second rule Answer. C. Three-second rule. It provides a safe following distance in most conditions. Question 21. When it starts to rain, roads are often slickest. A. During a heavy downpour B. In the first few minutes of rainfall. C. After it has been raining for a couple of hours. Answer. B. In the first few minutes of rainfall, accumulated oils rise to the surface making it slippery. Question 22. When two vehicles arrive at an uncontrolled intersection, no signs or signals, at the same time. A. The vehicle on the left yields to the vehicle on the right. B. The vehicle on the right yields to the vehicle on the left. C. The larger vehicle has the right of way. Answer. A. The vehicle on the left yields to the vehicle on the right. Question 23. True or false? You may make a left turn on a red light when turning from a one-way street to another one-way street. Answer. True. After coming to a complete stop, and ensuring the way is clear of pedestrians and vehicles. Question 24. If a blind pedestrian is waiting at a crosswalk with a white cane or a guide dog, A. Honk to let them know you're there. B. Wait for them to cross the street. C. Proceed slowly around them. Answer. B. Wait for them to cross the street. Blind pedestrians have the right of way. Question 25. A school bus ahead of you in your lane has stopped with red lights flashing. You should A. Stop and wait B. Slow down and proceed with caution C. Pass the bus on the left Answer A. Stop and wait. Do not pass until the red lights stop flashing. Question 26. If you see a do not pass sign, you should A. Wait for a passing zone B. Honk and pass cautiously. C. Pass only if the way ahead is clear. Answer. A. Wait for a passing zone. The sign indicates areas where passing is unsafe. Question 27. True or false. You may cross double yellow lines to pass another vehicle if the top line is broken. Answer. False. You may only cross if the broken line is on your side. Question 28. If your vehicle starts to hydroplane, you should A. Accelerate to gain control B. Brake suddenly C. Ease off the gas pedal and steer in the direction you want to go Answer. C. Ease off the gas pedal and steer in the direction you want to go Question 29. If you're involved in a collision, you should A. Move your car off the road, if possible B. Leave your car in its current position. C. Wait inside the car for police to arrive. Answer. A. Move your car off the road, if possible. This reduces the risk of subsequent collisions. Question 30. When driving in fog, you should use A. High beams. B. Low beams. C. No lights. Answer. B low beams. High beams can reflect back and further reduce visibility. Question 31. True or false? 
When a traffic signal is not working, treat the intersection as a four-way stop. Answer. True. Each driver should take turns proceeding through the intersection. Question 32. If you encounter an aggressive driver, you should A. Challenge them B. Avoid eye contact and give them space C. Honk and show your displeasure Answer B. Avoid eye contact and give them space. It's safer to avoid escalating the situation. Question 33. A curb painted green indicates A. No stopping or parking B. Time limit parking C. Loading zone. Answer. B. Time limit parking. Check nearby signs for the time limit. Question 34. True or false. Motorcycles have the same rights and responsibilities as other vehicles on the road. Answer. True. Always give motorcycles a full lane width. Question 35. If you approach a roundabout, you should. A. Enter without yielding. B. Yield to vehicles already in the roundabout. C. Enter at any speed. Answer. B. Yield to vehicles already in the roundabout. Question 36. When driving at night, you should. A. Follow closely behind other vehicles to see better. B. Use your high beams whenever possible. C. Be extra cautious and increase your following distance. Answer. C. Be extra cautious and increase your following distance. Question 37. True or false? It's acceptable to wear headphones or earbuds while driving as long as one ear is uncovered. Answer. True. But it's safer to avoid such distractions. Question 38. In California, you may make a right turn against a red light. A. Without stopping. B. After coming to a full stop and checking that the turn is safe. C. Only during non-peak hours. Answer. B. After coming to a full stop and checking that the turn is safe. Question 39. The speed limit in a business or residential district, unless otherwise posted, is A. 20 miles per hour. B. 25 miles per hour. C. 30 miles per hour. Answer. B. 25 miles per hour. Always watch for pedestrians in these areas. Question 40. True or false? You're allowed to smoke inside a vehicle if you're transporting a minor. Answer. False. It's illegal in California to smoke in a vehicle with a minor present. Question 41. Which of the following is a common effect of alcohol? A. Improved concentration. B. Reduced coordination. C. Quicker reactions. Answer. B. Reduced coordination. Question 42. If a police officer is directing traffic at an intersection, you should A. Follow the traffic signals. B. Follow the officer's instructions. C. Proceed only when the way is clear. Answer. B. Follow the officer's instructions. Question 43. True or false? It's illegal to follow closer than 300 feet behind any emergency vehicle responding to an alarm. Answer. True. Maintain a safe distance. Question 44. When should you use your vehicle's horn? A. To greet someone you know. B. To alert others of your presence in potential danger situations. C. To express frustration or anger. Answer. B. To alert others of your presence in potential danger situations. Question 45. When parking downhill with a curb, turn your wheels. A. Towards the curb. B. Away from the curb. C. Straight ahead. Answer. A. Towards the curb. This ensures the car will roll into the curb if it starts moving. Question 46. True or false? You may pass a school bus with flashing red lights if you're on the other side of a divided highway. Answer. True. The divider acts as a barrier, but always proceed with caution. Question 47. If you're driving and become tired, you should A. Turn up the radio. B. Drink coffee. C. Pull over and rest. Answer. C. Pull over and rest. It's dangerous to drive drowsy. 
Question 48. A curb painted white indicates A. No stopping, standing, or parking. B. Loading zone for passengers or mail. C. Unlimited parking. Answer. B. Loading zone for passengers or mail. Question 49. True or false. When backing up, you must yield the right of way to all vehicles, bicycles, and pedestrians. Answer. True. Always ensure the way is clear before backing up. Question 50. Which of the following actions contributes most to distracted driving? A. Adjusting the radio. B. Eating or drinking. C. Texting or using a smartphone. Answer. C. Texting or using a smartphone. It takes your eyes, hands, and attention away from driving. Question 51. In heavy rain, you should reduce your speed by A. 5 miles per hour B. 10 miles per hour C. Whatever is safe for conditions Answer. C. Whatever is safe for conditions. It's essential to drive at a speed that ensures safety. Question 52. True or false? If you miss your exit on a freeway, you should back up. Answer. False. Never back up on a freeway. Proceed to the next exit. Question 53. You're required to stop your vehicle. A. At all crosswalks. B. Only at marked crosswalks. C. At crosswalks where a pedestrian is waiting or crossing. Answer. C. At crosswalks where a pedestrian is waiting or crossing. Question 54. In roundabout, vehicles. A. Always yield to entering vehicles. B. Always have the right of way over entering vehicles. C. Must alternate with entering vehicles. Answer. B. Always have the right of way over entering vehicles. Question 55. True or false? It's legal to drive with an open container of alcohol in the vehicle if you're not drinking it. Answer. False. It's illegal to have an open container of alcohol in the vehicle. Question 56. If you approach a yellow traffic signal, you should A. Speed up to beat the red light. B. Proceed with caution if you can't stop safely. C. Always stop, even if you can proceed through the intersection. Answer. B. Proceed with caution if you can't stop safely. Question 57. When parking next to a red painted curb, you A. Can park for up to 10 minutes. B. Cannot park, stop, or stand. C. Can park if you're running quick errands. Answer. B. Cannot park, stop, or stand. Question 58. True or false. Seat belts are optional for passengers over 18. Answer. False. Seat belts are required for all passengers, regardless of age. Question 59. When two vehicles meet on a steep road where neither can pass, which one should back up? A. The vehicle facing downhill. B. The vehicle facing uphill. C. The heavier vehicle. Answer. A. The vehicle facing downhill. This is because they have better control when backing up. Question 60. Before entering a highway from an alley, building, or private driveway, you should A. Slow down and proceed with caution. B. Stop and yield the right of way to all approaching vehicles. C. Signal and merge immediately. Answer. B. Stop and yield the right of way to all approaching vehicles. Question 61. True or false? Flashing yellow arrow traffic signals indicate that you should yield to oncoming traffic and pedestrians before turning. Answer. True. Oncoming traffic has the right of way. Question 62. Which of the following statements about large trucks is false? A. They have longer stopping distances than smaller vehicles. B. They have smaller blind spots than most passenger vehicles. C. Their drivers often cannot see cars directly behind or beside them. Answer. B. They have smaller blind spots than most passenger vehicles. Question 63. If you see a solid white line between lanes of traffic, you should A. Change lanes B. Stay in your lane C. 
Only change lanes if you're in the leftmost lane. Answer. B. Stay in your lane. Solid white lines indicate lane changes are discouraged. Question 64. True or false. When turning left, yield the right of way to oncoming traffic until it's safe to turn. Answer. True. Oncoming traffic has the right of way. Question 65. Before driving, you should always A. Adjust your seat and mirrors. B. Set your radio. C. Check your phone for messages. Answer. A. Adjust your seat and mirrors. It's essential to have a clear view and be seated comfortably. Question 66. If your brakes fail while driving, you should A. Shift to a lower gear and use the parking brake slowly. B. Pump the brake pedal rapidly. C. Turn off the engine immediately. Answer. B. Pump the brake pedal rapidly. Question 67. When driving behind another vehicle at night, you should use A. High beams. B. Low beams. C. Fog lights. Answer. B. Low beams. High beams can blind the driver in front of you. Question 68. When you're merging onto a freeway, you should be driving. A. At or near the same speed as the freeway traffic. B. Slower than the freeway traffic. C. Faster than the freeway traffic. Answer. A. At or near the same speed as the freeway traffic. Question 69. To see vehicles in your blind spots, you should. A. Rely on your mirrors alone. B. Glance over your shoulders. C. Honk your horn. Answer. B. Glance over your shoulders. Question 70. True or false? It's safe to drive beside a motorcycle in the same lane. Answer. False. Motorcycles need a full lane to operate safely. Question 71. True or false? During light rain or drizzle, roads can become more slippery than during heavy rain because oil and dust have not been washed away. Answer. True. The initial moisture can mix with oil and dust, making the road surface slick. Question 72. When you hear a siren coming from an unseen emergency vehicle, you should A. Continue driving until you see the vehicle. B. Pull over to the right and stop. C. Increase your speed to get out of the way. Answer. B. Pull over to the right and stop. It's essential to clear the path for emergency vehicles. Question 73. In California, if a child is under the age of 8 and less than 4 feet 9 inches in height, they must be secured in A. The front seat with a seat belt. B. A federally approved child passenger restraint system in the back seat. C. An adult's lap. Answer. B. A federally approved child passenger restraint system in the back seat. Question 74. True or false? If you're involved in a collision, you should move your car out of the traffic lane if it's safe to do so. Answer. True. Moving out of the traffic lane can prevent additional collisions and keep traffic flowing. Question 75. When driving on a road with no center dividing marking and there are two or more lanes in your direction, you should drive. A. In the middle lane. B. In the right must lane. C. In any lane as long as you're at the speed limit. Answer. B. In the right must lane. Slower traffic should keep right, and the left lane is for overtaking slower vehicles.